Hello everyone and welcome to the One Man Renegade Productions YouTube channel. I'm your host, the Honorable Greg B. And today we are doing some more packs from this 2003 Tops Series 2 MLB Baseball Home Team Advantage, a.k.a. Jumbo Box. Uh, if you missed last week, check it out up there. While you're at it, head on down, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit the thumbs up, like the video, hit the share button, share this with everyone in the world. Head over in the comments and say hi. Uh, tell me who you think's going to get in the Hall of Fame as, well, we'll talk about it in a second. Um... And then uh, check out the links in the description for my podcast, blog, other social media, including my eBay, where I have a bunch of stuff up for sale. So go over there and check it out. Make some offers, buy some stuff if you want to. Uh, it's mostly wrestling stuff right now, but eventually I will have some cards and stuff up there as time goes by. Well, actually, by the time you're watching this, I don't know what I have up there. But as I'm recording this, I have a bunch of wrestling stuff. So if you're interested in that, whatever, check it out. Uh, all right, so Hall of Fame. I mentioned the Hall of Fame in the comments. Tell me who you think is going to make the Hall of Fame because last week I was speculating i was like well wait a minute i'm recording this ahead of time i forget when they do the announcements so by the time that video went up i was like maybe they already announced well nope it didn't happen it's happening today the 25th of january if my calculations are correct this video should go up 25th of january sometime in the, in the early in the morning um eastern time and then later today they'll make the announcements at some point of who made the hall of fame now as i'm recording this right now the only guy that's tracking and it's way really it's still way too early uh to know but the only guy that's tracking to be a hall of famer is david ortiz who's the first year ballot um so that'd be a bit surprising given his the fact that he's dh you know whatever people there's still those guys that are like oh well, he's just a dh you know he didn't play in the field very much blah 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 whatever i mean edgar martinez made it so i think by the you know i mean you know since he's in there i don't see there's any reason to like knock a guy for being a dh at this point but then there was some you know speculation about peds at some point because he was on some list that shouldn't have existed no one knows knew what it was for or what they were testing for or what anything about it and it should have got out and his name was on it so of course everyone went crazy and speculating whatever um but he's the only one tracking bonds and clemens are slightly behind um the 75 percent you need and Schilling has fallen way off because everyone hates him. But um it has nothing to do with his actual performance on the field. But hey, you know, I mean, I guess none of what's going on with these guys actually has to do with their performance on the field. It was the stuff off the field. And they were, or whatever they were maybe using before they got on the field uh, that is causing the guys' problems. Um, A-Rod, the other guy that's like brand new to the list... Um, He's only getting about 50% right now, so I don't think he's going to make it. Certainly not on the first um, ballot because of a lot of, you know, his off-field off stuff or, you know, PED stuff and all that suspension and whatnot. All right, we got to do three more packs today. Um, enough of me babbling on about the uh, Hall of Fame. Uh, but, yeah, tell me in the, in the comments who you think will make it into the Hall of Fame this year when they announce it later on today and then they'll go in in july all right we got garrett anderson ken griffey jr who's a, obviously a hall of famer uh jorge julio Raul ibanez tori hunter john smoltz hall of famer uh, ryan klesko got jeff jenkins darren erstad who should have gotten his autograph out of the first out of the series one box but it was a redemption and long since expired mike sweeney carlos pena rafael pomero who probably would have been a hall of famer if not for the ped stuff uh todd pratt robin ventura freddie garcia uh todd helton record breaker ryan jansen uh gold card brad osmus randy johnson who's a hall of famer of course oliver perez todd helton again um Todd Elton, is he still on the list? That's a good question. He is. He's getting about 55% right now. Jay Payton, I don't know how many more years he has of eligibility, but obviously this year he's not really tracking. I don't know if he'll bump up, um, maybe. I don't know. Willis, Robert, Morgan, Enberg, Denny Stark, uh, Tony Fiore, Octavio Dotel, Paul Quantrill, Latroy Hawkins, Julio Franco, D'Angelo Jimenez, Alex Cora, of course, the manager of the Red Sox. 
John Garland and Scott Spezio round things out for that pack. Um, the other guy, the other guy I was talking about earlier, uh, um, or in the last video, oh Scott Rowland, that was the other guy that I meant to look up. He's at seventy two percent, so you know, given you know, let's we'll see what happens. You know, obviously it's still early. It's, you know, it's only I don't. It's only it says fifty nine public ballots plus three anonymous. Um, so percent of ballots known is only 15% according to this list I'm looking at. So, um, I don't know. I'm sure it changed a lot more since, you know, I'm recording this. Um, but, um, yeah, you never know. J.D. Drew. Is J.D. Drew on the list, by the way? No. Okay. Uh, Jason Schmidt. I forget when he retired, so. Ben Broussard. Nick Johnson. J Joe Mays. Rob Macau... Mac Makowiak, sure. John Franco, Doug Mankiewicz, Tim Salmon, Tomas Perez, Milton Bradley, Dave Berg, Armando Benitez, Boomer Wells, another one of those guys that they, for whatever reason, said, hey, let's use his nickname instead of his real regular name. I don't know. Uh, Quinton, I mean, it's one thing with, like, Chipper Jones. Everyone called him Chipper Jones, but, like, Boomer Wells, like... I think a lot of people are still calling him David Wells. I don't think Boomer was kind of like his nickname. Like, I don't know. Quentin McCracken, uh, Benji Gill. We got Hip Parade of Fred McGriff. We got a Mark Pryor throwback. 1951 throwback, I believe that is. Uh, Eric Chavez. Eric Hinsky. Tom Glavin, Hall of Famer. Chuck Finley. Who, well... I once told I once said he was dead. He's not dead. He was not dead. His his for his ex wife died. That's what happened. Paul Wilson, Arthur Rhodes, Frank Catalanato, uh, Antonio Osun Osuna, John Mabry, David Bell, Mark Manti, Jeremy Guthrie, Lee Travis Lee, uh, Tim Spoonie Barker, Keith Folk. Um, sorry, Eric Caros, Sandy Alomar Jr. and no shoebox required. I don't know. Some sort of E tops thing. E tops. See, you know, a lot of people talk about the, the NFTs and stuff, and like, you know, Top Shot, I remember, was a big thing with the NBA and whatever. And it was like, then, then like Tops did their own type of thing, and it's like, they've been doing that sort of thing forever. So it's like, how, why is this a new thing? Um, but whatever. I don't want to get into NFT stuff, I don't want to talk about it. I'm a physical collector. That's what I do. I wouldn't have this channel if I didn't. That wouldn't make any sense. So, for me, that's that stuff's not really for me. I've dabbled a little bit in Top Shot, but eh. All right, last pack for today. Uh, then we'll come back next week. We'll do another three packs, another stack of packs, and we'll see what we can find. Uh, Edgar Renteria, Sammy Sosa, uh, Chicago Cubs. Sammy Sosa still on the list, by the way. Uh, yeah, Sammy Sosa is still on the list. He's at trending at 16%, so I don't think he's going to make it. Chicago Cubs, Mets, we got Utley and Gavin Floyd. Uh, Mark, Marky Brewers, uh, Rockies, Aaron Hellman, and Jose Reyes. I'm trying to think who else is on this list that might be in this, in this, uh, well, we, uh, last week we saw Pettit. Talked about him. Uh, he's at 14.5%. Manny Ramirez is at up to 40%. I feel like that's kind of high. Uh, Braves, Athletics, Cardinals. Wait, Braves is second. Phillies, Cardinals, Angels. Lots of team cards there. Dontrell Willis and Jason Stokes. Then we got a record breakers of Ted Klus... Kl Clues says says with wow I can't talk. Ted Klusevsky. What? Ted Klusevsky? I don't know. Uh, then we got Shushi Shingo Gold. I can't say these names today. Kenny Rogers, Andrew Jones, uh, Sterling Hitchcock. Then we got Eli Marrero, Scott Stewart. Fernando Tatis, but not Junior. Uh, Jose Hernandez, uh, Daryl Ward, 
uh, Scott Strickland, Chris Gomez, Jeff Supon, Jose Macias, Jeremy Giambi, Cliff Floyd, Damian Moss, rookie gold cup card, Reggie Sanders, and Cliff Polite. Pol 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 yeah, it was, I mean, <laughs> Fernando Tatis. Yeah, it'd be really funny if there's Fernando Tatis Jr. card. Well, was he even born then? When was Fernando Tatis Jr. born? Fern Fernando. Uh, let's see. What year was he born? Oh, 99. Yeah, so he was born. I don't know. I, f I, f I don't know how, how young, how old these young kids are these days. Uh, he, I mean, he's 22. I guess, yeah, I guess if he was born 2003, he's only 19, 18, 19. So, yeah. <laughs> he's been around for a few years. I guess that wouldn't make it, wouldn't make any sense. Uh, but it would be funny if he was on the card with his dad or something. Be like, hey, this is actually Fernando Tatis Jr.'s rookie card because he was on a card with his dad. Think about it, right? Uh, I mean, I'm sure there's one with Guerrero, right? Somewhere. I know they did like a one with him. Like there was a short print recently, I think, with him with his dad from like an All-Star game. But it'd be interesting if there was another card that like existed at some point where he's with his like dad. I don't know. I guess not. Maybe. I don't know. It'd be cool. I don't know. I'm babbling. All right. That's going to do it for today. Uh, we got a hip parade. I always like the hip parade cards. Um, I don't know why they stopped making them. Uh, record breakers. Gold card. A 51 throwback. Some Hall of Famers. Some potential Hall of Famers, although he's not trending that direction. And uh, Sammy Sosa, I don't think, will be a Hall of Famer. Um but yeah, that's going to do it for today. Uh, thank you everyone for watching. Uh, come back next week. We'll do another the two more or another stack of packs. We got two more left to go. Um, but uh, come back every day. I got videos posted every time. Time multiple in the day. There should be another tops.com Tuesday video coming up later on today. So if you subscribe, hit the notification bell, then you'll know the, you'll get the notification that the videos are ready to watch, and then you can watch them. Um, thank you everyone for watching. Stay safe. Have fun. Have fun. Have fun. I can't talk. Um, stay safe. Have fun. Talk to you next time. Bye.